Ladies and gentlemen, we'd like to welcome you to the Beans and Rice Show. First up, we have one of our lovely hosts, host Beefy666, Love Bastion. Yes, sir, he's got long hair and he don't care. He's going to do whatever he likes because he likes it that way. Next up, we have multiple Academy Award winner. He's got best actor, best supporting actor, and many other accolades. Butter Pecan, Puerto Rican. Next up is our love lady on the ones and twos, representing the lesbian community. She loves the ladies, and the ladies love her, our Wizard of Oz, Ice Agent Alice. And last but not least, we got the man of the Lord. He walks in faith, so you should too. Good book being presented. Shouts out to God, Mr. J48 Javi. Beans and rice. Enjoy the show. April 2nd, 2024. What a ride 2024 has been. And we don't have the title belt with us. Even though this would be, what, week five? Week five. Week five. The reason we don't have it is because it's being cleaned. Imagine being it dragged everywhere. Oh, yeah. Through some of these places that we had to go to. Go to Dead you know? skin cells, a bunch of reasty ah. people, some scumbags, some scuzzy people. Bunch of minorities. A lot yeah. of minorities are trying to touch the belt. You know minorities, they love gold, right? Oh, they love gold. Oh, those diamonds? Oh. Bro. Oh. <laughs> they thought I was a god! <laughs> King Takunta. What could they the yeah. wrestling god. <laughs> J-B-L. J B L. Long story short, it was contaminated by a bunch of people. We don't want their grimy fingerprints. We don't want their DNA. Uh, nothing but Puritans over here. Oh, yeah. God's chosen people over here. So we had to go get it professionally cleaned. And that's why we don't have it physically with us. But it's still, you know, it's but still. But we still deserve it. Yeah, we still deserve it. But yeah, it was pretty nice. You know what? I was actually, we were supposed to have a guest today. And it was kind of nice taking a little bit of a break. Because we took a break last week. Yeah. Well, we didn't. Host and we I, we didn't. We didn't take a break. We just didn't post an episode. Yeah. Instead, we recorded a few, uh, several episodes for dissecting the songs. If you haven't checked those out, go check them out. Yeah, because and then that one was uh, we forgot how to record those. Well, the setup on the computer, you know. Yeah, and it was tripping us out because I swear I remembered it correctly. Like I'm, uh, I said, everything is correct. Then he swore it was a different way, and then when he just checks noise suppression after two hours. That's really what was holding you know? us back was the noise suppression. Damn. So so we stayed. We hung out for four hours extra, you know? Yeah. And honestly, we were sick of each other, too, you know? Like, I was, yeah. I'd... We were only trying to do, like, an hour, and then it was like, oh, come on. Now and we have that here. kind of friendship. A lot of you guys don't know when to tell someone uh, that you appreciate Enough is love. enough. Yeah, yeah, you don't know when to tell like, someone that you appreciate yeah. <laughs> You know? We were sick of each other. It's like, bro, we've been working the last, like, three weeks. We've like, been three, around. Three yeah. weeks. We like our three space days. and our own time. You so. know? Uh, I didn't paint as much these past two weeks. Oh, no. He just had a pain without the tea, yeah, huh? Without the tea. <laughs> Especially my dog. I had to take my dog to the ER. Oh. She's doing fine now. Um, but that took a lot of energy out of me because I feel really bad. When, yeah, when you get worried, that's what happens, huh? Like, cause I, and the worst part about it is a dog can't tell you yeah they can't tell you that they're okay like like oh i don't feel the best but i'm comfortable unless now they have well, I mean, maybe we're gonna have to hit the youtubers now they got the white people now they can talk to dogs have you seen that stuff wow oh, i thought that was a mexican season milan you know? oh Shout no, that's to, mental that's telekinesis whisper, yeah. <laughs> now they got white Six people nine. on the dog board dog board you haven't seen that host? No. bro maybe we gotta make a patent of this dog board yeah just put that they can talk to them man they teach oh, them. it's when they hit the thing and they yeah, communicate and it says back. like, "I'm hungry, Dad. I am hungry." <laughs> oh, the I talking dog. It. Yeah, let's look it up. One of the first things was a black guy. Look, two black guys huh, on her feet. Come this on, this guy, man. right? It's a talking dog. Yeah, look at that speaker. Look on that one. Look at that. Okay, it's afternoon now. We talk now. What talk? What talk, huh? Maybe she's getting a little deviant to us. Yeah, we did a lot of talking this morning. Oh, I was telling her to shut the fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> this like... Oh, that's it. It's because maybe this lady, let's not do this because this lady, you know, she doesn't have friends, so she doesn't have hobbies. No, she only has So dogs. the only thing is a poor dog she's going to talk to, you know? Copper, what is it? 
Outside pool. <laughs> Outside pool, maybe tomorrow. Soon. <laughs> Outside pool, soon. Outside pool, later. I love the face. So cute. Outside pool, later. Outside pool. Later. Outside pool, later. It's going to Not happen. soon. Boy, oh, look how mad he is, huh? He's, He's not like, happy. Bro, I learned how to talk just for this, <laughs> huh? <laughs> Why did I learn to talk? <laughs> Bitch. Oh, <laughs> <my God. laughs> I Dude, that's he's it. better at complaining than some of these women on IG, oh, you know? Dang, boy, wow, that's pretty cool, huh? That is oh, look, cool. that's Hobby's old dog up there. Did you see it? Right here? <laughs> I'm glad he's doing okay. <laughs> But maybe we need to get you one of these devices. You don't think so, Hoss? Maybe. When your puppy gets a little ill. And maybe you could have mm. given her the pill to a beast. I should have called you. <laughs> wasn't there one of these dogs that got hella depressed because it became like too sentient? Oh, really? Yeah. Dude, like, that's from like, the Bible, huh? Isn't that the story of Moses? I don't know. No? I don't read the Bible. Or no? I just Noah's carried Hulk? around. Huh? <laughs> no? <laughs> Isn't that what it was? It became aware of its own surroundings. <laughs> that's, that's what AI means, right? <laughs> Can you not want to play? <laughs> the dog became an AI, essentially. <laughs> Alexander Sab. An animal intelligent. You know what I mean? Can animal. Edward play? <laughs> <laughs> that would be some creepy shit. Edward Sab. He was a great bane. <laughs> Imagine. That would be a great thing. You know, Lisa Hoss? That's how they would talk. Yeah, they, yeah, they would, yeah. Because, dude, you got a couple, like, it a husky. Sad. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's, like, so big, and you know how they take those low steps? Yeah. <laughs> and they always sound like you fold a blanket when they sit down. Have you noticed? Like, yeah. right then? Or one of those big dogs? It's like... <laughs> and then you feel the gust of wind three yeah. seconds later. Oh, look how he's looking for a Mexican one. A Chihuahua one. Yeah, I think it might be this one. Oh, it's the same one. Look. The poor one with the lady that talks oh, too dude, much. It's not because he's sentient. It's because look at his owner. Uh, Who? Who is it? That owner looks kind of creepy. Look at the house. You know what I mean? No, I think you were talking about a different one. Maybe, I don't know. Okay, we can't watch this for another two minutes, Savi. Come on, man. But he tried to get you guys the videos what he's trying to say, okay? Yeah, maybe if you guys want to do a deep dive into this, talking dogs. And then... Be needs a <laughs> needs a therapist. Yeah. Uh, that would be sad. Huh? Even the dogs are sad. Can you believe that now in America, Hoss? Remember yeah. back in America in the say they do? you think a dog would be sad? Dude, they would be in the streets. Uh, Early this, 2000s I, was the greatest peak of all time for America. Absolutely. You know, yeah. dogs were out. They had freaking... Now, Paw Patrol. Caesar Milano Paw was Patrol. running Dude, the now, world. You give the dog right, Caesar would give him a fucking left hook. The right hook, man. The a Sandy hook. hook. You know? Dogs still complaining. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> And now, dude, is like, dude, dude no, imagine, you can't even talk to a dude, dog. As a okay? dog, think of a dog, right? They have to pass on memories. They talk to each other. Yeah. Oh, I was adopted by this loving family. Or maybe even, oh, I was bred, but at least a loving family has me. So I have this fucking emotional bitch. I'm an emotional support dog. Service dogs have a lot of pride for obvious reasons, but emotional support dog? Uh, imagine. Shout out to Lefty. You know what I mean? Or who was it that needs to... Uh... I don't know. Oh, no, shout out to Quas McCody. <laughs> Quas McCody. No, he, he said he need, he was going to get him service dog. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's he going to train him to be service. Yeah. yeah, that makes sense. Oh, so it's a service. It's different yep. than emotional support, huh? Yep. Yeah, because it's like... Yeah. Dude, and do you know one thing I am going to call out? One of my sons, Santos, you know? Mm -hmm. He's got a song out right now, but it's... He's been making a song with Young Mary. You know, they're both my kids, but they keep doing promos at, like, the Humane Society... The shelter. They Has he adopted like the, one animal? No, they go to like oh the abandoned puppy God. palace. You know, the abandoned cat's corner. You know what I mean? <laughs> recovering cats. Them. They, you know? <laughs> he, dude, he went to recovering cats with a couple of cats that were over there with needles. They were, just, they were going like this. Oh, they're that's people like, so dilated. That's like me going to the women's center. Come on now. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're not saving any of that. <laughs> Don't yeah. save her. She don't want to but, be saved. Give me a coupon, you please. See, you see all the animals? How happy were they, Hoss? I want a coupon. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, man. How happy were the, the, the animals' faces? Oh, they so, weren't happy. You know? They had a camera in their face documenting they know their they're misery. Using it, yeah. For yeah. It's, like when, it's like the equivalent of like 
when people are like, oh, you gave a burger to the homeless, but you recorded it. Yeah. You know, then sometimes even the homeless But at least the, burglar, uh, the homeless got a burger. Yeah. He takes it back after the video's yeah. over. <laughs> Give me that shit back. That. <laughs> that would be funny. Huh? Or it's a prop burger. It's like a plastic one. <laughs> Damn, we should have done that yesterday for April Fool's. So oh, we should have. Just give people, like, uh, there's, like, nice kinds of, act- of uh, kindness, and yeah. then we take it back. Yeah. <laughs> he paid for your drink. No, I charged my drink on your drink. <laughs> because you were so kind, sir, we'd love to give you $5,000. Yeah. Unfortunately, it's April Fool's. April Fool's. <laughs> You cut them a check, right? We're actually going to need to check. You wait for them to only... cry because their life has changed. They just don't know how it's changed for the <laughs> worse. <laughs> oh my God. You don't know what this means to me. You You're right. Okay. You, know, you <laughs> don't even know what it means to you. What other acts of service could we do that we're pretending to do something nice, you know? Oh, let me pump your gas, you know? But then we put yeah. sugar in there too, you know what I mean? <laughs> so, yeah. You put diesel. <laughs> <laughs> Just the best of the best. Yeah. So are, we, are we gonna do it to American cars? Of course. Come not. on, no reason. All the imports. All you terrorists out there yeah. with your terror taxis, you fucking foreigners, you know? your tundras, <laughs> you know, your Lexuses. Dude, they're scared of the border, but they don't the care BMWs. about the borders for all the freaking influx of terrorist cars that are coming into the country. Of course not, yeah. Right? Toyota Avalon. Oh, the Volkswagen? Yeah. Ah. The Third Reich is Volkswagen. coming out. <laughs> Volkswagen? Come on, man. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. The flood of insurgency, that started with the cars. If and if you rearrange the V and the W for Volkswagen... You can make a specific symbol that has been outlawed. You think so? Oh, you can. <laughs> you go you like cut it up a little <laughs> bit. Like you start turning it to a cross. A cross with a couple little flags at the end of the cross. What do you have? The Hashtag Lord. Hashtag me too. You know what I mean? A swas, <laughs> a swas taika, you know? Yeah. Swas taika TD. And shout out to the Lord, Javi. Did you do anything for the Lord? I I went to church. That was it. I didn't really? do no Easter eggs, no nothing, you know? Or he didn't rise His hand house? looked like that for me to just be empty. Huh? <laughs> he didn't rise no i mean he did rise yeah for you guys he didn't like what do you guys do like when the like you wake up on easter you know that he is risen what do you do like do you feel extra like how do you feel when... he's spitting game he's risen you know? yeah he's <laughs> risen out of these bitches getting all that all the pussy. prostitutes huh? <laughs> Dude, come on man, he got that mary they were using you for clout jesus come on man <laughs> Oh, this shit. All the Instagram thoughts uh-huh. were after. Oh, he's oh, so hot. Jesus. <laughs> Look at his power. All for the clout, you know? Give me a minute. Same with Judas, you know what I mean? Yeah, of course. Dude, Judas was like the original Diddy. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, he was. He's selling him for coins. He was the to, original like, Dalai Lama. <laughs> 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 trying to market Jesus. You know, yeah. Jesus was like Biggie, kind of. You know yeah. what I mean? He's out there. <laughs> he doesn't money, know, money. He's not a bad eye. You know what I mean? Yeah. He can see the Lord through. You know, he can see God with yeah. this eye. This eye is for the mortal. So he's got that bad eye. And Jesus, you know. Nobody <laughs> till somebody <laughs> kills you. <laughs> what happened? Huh? And he did. And he's the best person we know. Yeah, because what happened also? Remember uh, Biggie had a song, Suicidal? Thoughts. Okay, and who went to the garden enough? Get Sep, uh, Gersephone, and then what? It's Gethsemane. When you read the Bible, you open up the Bible, you know, and when you start reading, you know, he's he's there, Jesus, and you read the first couple of verses that's when I die, I want to go. You know, he starts saying the same song that I want to go to hell. Yeah, because I'm a piece of shit. And who's trying to say, hey, if you jump off the cliff, I'll catch you. Who's trying to say that? Take Sat- a wild guess. Huh? Who do you think? Satanas. Mr. Satan. Ah, he was Dragon that, Ball Z. So Diddy. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> another guy that's trying to make profit you know what i mean yeah, oh yeah yeah true. see yep. so uh judas uh what is it always knew he was a prophet but he couldn't find a decent job but or job if you're reading the bible oh damn oh, that was nice yeah. dude but i was gonna say judas uh spinoff into dragon ball c spinoff into pop culture spinoff into me busted. Busted. busted okay so he's like the original you know what I mean? People want to be like him because we listened to some Lady Gaga and she was also giving him props, huh? Giving Judas props, yep. He's like the man. Without Judas, there is no salvation for mankind, actually. Nope. No. Somebody I mean, had to do it. Yeah, somebody uh, had to. And I'm glad it wasn't me. And Gangster <laughs> Rap made him do it. You yeah. know what I mean? <laughs> Listening to Diddy. Yeah. <laughs> Because <laughs> we're bad boys for life. We I can't am be going somewhere. <laughs> I am going somewhere. 
Yeah, that was pretty nice. What about you for the Lord? Did he rise for you, Hoss, or not? Uh, I did a couple prayers. Appreciated yeah. some things in my life. Yeah, you cast but a I pray spells? every day now. I didn't cast any spells. Good spells, isn't that a good spell? Like a, a good prayer is like a spell or not? I wasn't casting any spells. No, I was just basically a prayer of gratitude. Yeah, yeah. And then, so your whole family has to do it, or you just did it on your own? Oh, we did as a family before we ate. Oh, uh, really? Meal. You guys yeah. had an Easter feast? Yeah, we do it every year. Oh, how come you didn't invite me, host? Because we were fucking tired of each other. Right? Yeah, we God, were. God, man. <laughs> fucking Utah rapper. <laughs> <laughs> 48 in the lake. 48 in the lake. Get your tickets. Pay-per-view still out. Okay? That's the only reason I went. <laughs> Mr. J48. <laughs> because it's 48 in the lake. 48 in the lake. Oh. I had to be Dude, there. Dude, he threw the event. Hobby, no, huh? Mr. J48. Well, J isn't for Jared. J is for Hobby. Oh, hobby. Oh, uh, hobby funding 48 in the lake myth, myth busted, busted. Oh, come you on. mean jerry funding it myth busted but yeah you get it yeah <laughs> <laughs> damn yeah. But what kind of things did you guys have for freaking uh Easter? costilla so we made ribs, oh, damn. ribs. emphasis on the cost you know yeah. what i mean costilla how much did it cost uh, was that on purpose like uh, you... it left my <laughs> wallet holocaust <laughs> <laughs> Because you know the Lord, he bled from his ribs, yeah. so... He you, got stabbed in the ribs, to, okay? Just same with Adam, huh? Boom, they're off the rib. Adam, they happened to a trip, too, A woman remember? was made off the rib, yep. Yeah, it, it's all full, full circle. That's right? why... Marlon Manson? Yep. Right? Took eight, two of his own ribs. So, yeah, so he can eat so his So he can pee-pee. S his own D, okay? <laughs> Dude, actually, is this gay that I had a dream that I like was able to suck my pee-pee? <laughs> I don't think so. I remember, I was like, dude, I was like... Uh, only if you liked it is gay you know no, I, just re- I, just re- I just remember that i reached you know what i mean and that's when i woke up you're you doing know? too much yoga now that's the thing yeah. <laughs> you're too deep I'm into yoga fitness yeah. <laughs> it's a myth it's myth you know it's yoga a doesn't style yeah. yoga isn't demonic it's it turns it just turns people gay no, just being gay is a lifestyle <laughs> now i'm just in a lifestyle of sucking dicks yeah. you know what i mean <laughs> He, he fell into that pyramid scheme. <laughs> I'm at the top. Right now, I'm actually in the metal. You know, but I'm working on it. You know? His but... pronouns are he, brew, nationals, okay? <laughs> what Come a baseball on. scene. Slice of sausage. <laughs> they call me the fucking glissy gladiator. You know what I mean? <laughs> are you not entertained? <laughs> <laughs> that's after i finish you know what i mean they go down huh? yep. you know? joaquin phoenix yeah but that's not gay right host because no. i did have that dream no i don't think that's gay. okay because like damn bro i remember and it didn't click until right now that i had that dream and also i have another confession something bad happened okay i pooped my pants what? shut the fuck up. on saturday bro what'd you do we went to wing nuts remember you pooped your pants at wing nuts not at wing nuts here at the house oh. man after you ate the wings yeah, I just like, I, I thought I was just like letting a little bit, dude, and this is like, I thought it was just like a little bit of gas, you know what I mean? Because like I, and you know how you hear like fossils say this, like, oh, I thought I was just like, and you're like, dude, you, you should have said that chick that gave how, you her number. How could you have shit your pants, you know what I mean? Yeah. But it's just like, yeah, it was just like, just like a little tiny one, and literally I like pooped my pants. And it was like, I got rid of my underwear, obviously, right away, right? But then I'm like, oh, I think my pants should still be good. You got to rid of the pants, that, too? It was that much? Like, I saw maybe, like, a little bit. Okay. That's crazy. <laughs> I think my pants were made out of pumice, hoss. You know? <laughs> I have the pumice pants. <laughs> After looking like a fucking Flintstone. Oh, you yeah. know what I mean? You got the puma pants. <laughs> <laughs> It's <laughs> funny enough. I saw a meme about that. <laughs> about Puma? Yeah, the, it's like a little kid comes up to you, he's like, "Hey," and then it had Puma pants, like sweatpants. Yeah. It's like, "Hey," your kid comes up to you, he's like, "Hey, Dad, Puma pants." <laughs> yeah, what's happened to me, huh? It yeah. was kind of weird, man. I was like, I felt so weird. I mean, I did have some that- bowel movements quite a bit. I didn't, I didn't shit myself, thankfully, but I got home and then I realized, I'm like, oh, I had a couple bowel movements. Yeah. More than normal. What were you gonna say, Javi? Does that just scare you for the future? Like now you have to really think about if you have to fart or not. Well, I don't know. It's just weird. You but know? I think mine was the Guinness because that happens when I. Drink. Yeah, because we drank a little yeah. bit, and not am an athlete. My body dude it was like poison to. That's probably that. Yeah, yeah it's it just like you trying know? to get rid of the. He's like, trying to get rid of it because like it for the... an athlete to drink <laughs> alcohol. Your body was pressing the buttons <laughs> trying to talk to you. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> I hate this. <laughs> yeah. This is pointed. Sad. <laughs> Asshole is sad. <laughs> Please poop. let go. Poop. Poop. <laughs> Don't Exit. eat. Exit. Don't eat. 
<laughs> don't pee. <laughs> this is bad for you. <laughs> Dude, I should have taken Tony, huh? Who's going to eat our groceries? Because uh, that's oh, what they say in Mexico, huh? If you go to like a weird taco stand, they say that you have to take your dog and you throw a little piece. See if they'll eat it. Yeah. Oh, to know if it's good or not. No, no they say perro no come perro. That's what they say. Oh. That dog don't they eat do. dog. They do. So, but that's the myth in Mexico. They don't know. Dude, have you seen how Mexican street dogs? Yeah, I have. You know? They're wild, you know. <laughs> <laughs> They're some kind of hybrid inbred. They could probably already talk without that board. Probably. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so that's why we're like, we're not gonna eat each other. And Mexican dogs don't eat each other, bro. They already know that they're like getting mistreated you know what i mean <laughs> yeah they don't want to add to the it's like, we have to unite yeah. it's like a giant gang yeah <laughs> yeah they have gangs it's a guys. cartel <laughs> yeah. the emphasis weird. on the tail <laughs> yeah but that was kind of scary you know but i think it was that you don't think so maybe because we well i ate quite a bit and i was so hungry and guinness is weird i don't think i've ever had that's it. what it was also i got yeah. some guinness no i did you didn't oh. drink that you had a I got crown. Some peach cobbler or something like that oh it was peach good, cobbler. is the peach crown <laughs> peach crown dude it was so nice hobby I had never that's tried it. I was just like, that's exactly what he said. <laughs> I'm like, dude, this is what we have here. <laughs> you know, and now I'm an alcoholic and it. sucking my own dick. You yeah. know what I mean? God, maybe you are gay. <laughs> <laughs> Peach, I mean, I can't get any gay. Hey, come on. He's, he's the one that got the bottle, okay? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't drink it. I'm oh, kidding. Did, I didn't drink it. A little so bit. Good. Yeah, but it was really good, Hoss. Yeah. Should have made a peach cobbler uh, float. <laughs> yeah, that sounds good, actually. With alcohol? Yeah. Oh, I never thought about that. It'll shit yourself so. faster. You know, you got <laughs> you milk. Know, everything's got... mixing something yeah. rising to the top. Because that's what happens yeah. with alcohol. Does yeah, it rise may... to the top if you drink, like, milk or no? What's the well, density? Yeah, it's thinner. So oh, I, that would be I, weird. Milk, I think, is thicker. Yeah. I think. I could be wrong. It's more dense. Yeah. That would be kind of cool. Because it's fat, right? Milk yeah. has fat in it, so it's got to go lower. I don't know. That is weird. It's Somebody weird. tried it rises to the top because it's less dense. Also, then maybe yeah, maybe yeah. beer is then cream to the cream. Yeah, like when you so when you mix like a float, that's why it floats. It's cream, so it goes to the top. That's true. The cream rises to the top. You think the cream of the crop? That means it's the best. It's the top yeah, part. Yeah, and guys. you guys are the fucking liquor at the bottom. You don't think yeah. so? You guys are the glass. Okay, yeah. you wish you could be us. <laughs> <laughs> that people would partake you. Yeah, you know I mean, they're not gonna partake. Some of these people, Dude, do they go to church? We're so Easter? good. They drink us. They slam you to the ground. Come ask on, for another one. Yeah, and they call us tall boys too. You know yeah, they do. Us? And what's the other one called? They got the tall boy. A stein. A stein? <laughs> stein. Oh. <laughs> and that is what it's called, huh? Yes, it's a stein. Dang, dude. A pint and a stein. And it, it is because it's uh, Jewish? That's why it's called a stein? I'm not sure why the name stein is a thing. No, maybe can you look it up? Can Javi hit the Google host, do you think? I, Javi, you think you can type that for us? Uh, how do you spell stein? And I might... S-T-I-N. <laughs> E-I-N, sorry. E-I-E-I. Uh-oh. E-I-N. E-I-N? Yeah. Yeah, why is it called that? Yeah. God, he put that in reverse, huh? <laughs> He's fucking Yoda over here. <laughs> Stein what it called? <laughs> Stein called his what? <laughs> used to refer to... Uh, I'll read it for you. You, got, you think I can read it for the people that are maybe uh, listening? Yeah, you should have. Dude, they can't even read, Hoss. You already know that. Historically speaking, the word Stein used to refer to a beer drinking vessel coming from Stein at Steinzang, meaning stoneware, or Steinkrug, meaning stoneware jug. Some believe that steins were invented during bubonic plague with hinged lids to keep flies out of the beer. So it's German. Oh, damn. So they had, they're like the original Stanley Cubs, huh? The Germans? Yep. They were ahead of the time. But also, dude, come on. You can't make one out of wood. You're going to make it out of rock. <laughs> dude, they're so strong. <laughs> Just lifting up rocks all day. That no one, yeah. You, you that's what they drink so much. Ladies yeah. grab like ten of those and yeah. just fucking. Oh, yeah. How do they grab them, homie? Like this. <laughs> <laughs> Firmly grasp it, you know. <laughs> that's why they go nine, nine, <laughs> because they want nine inches, right, Hoss? Oh, absolutely, wow, boy. Nine inch nails. But you Shout know out what? to Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a favorite band, Hoss? You think so? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Aren't they anti? I think that's what right. they say, I, dude. But all the people that say that they love, you know what I mean? Yeah, they do it as like a way to get yeah. to people to click on them and click listen to them. They yeah. love the Lord. The original I mean? clickbait. Yeah, the original Band clickbait. Names. Is that is nails, true, yeah. huh? Because what else do they have? They have uh, Three Days Grace or some shit. Yep. And that's because they were always late. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, bro. On their on. payments? Yeah. Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> they were poor. Who else did they have? Death Row, right? Yep. Uh, what else? What else was there? Slipknot. Oh yeah, yeah. 
corn. Yeah. <laughs> they didn't eat that. You know what I mean? You guys are eating fucking eat wheat. Have you seen those guys? Yeah. Bro, they're... Bro, I'm on barley. That cream of wheat. They're celiacs. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. And fucking some of those idiots thought that it was a nice car. Oh, I'm going to go to celiac. You know what I mean? Shut the That's not a nice fucking car. <laughs> you you know? just don't know how to spell Cadillac, <laughs> you dumb fuck. <laughs> I'm going to get a but celiac SS. SS. <laughs> you're like, what the? No, you're not, dude. That means you're going to die, you freaking idiot. You know what I mean? Celiac SS pendejo. Uh, and and it's got chrome trims. You know what I mean? Yeah. Come on, man. Um. <laughs> Third Reich again, the SS. It's chromed right. out. You know what I mean? Dude, you freaking idiots, man. Some people, they don't know about the seas. It's not a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> But it is nice to know so many things. You don't think so? Sometimes you know Dude, just it's, it's almost like, a burden at times. You think so? Because you know too people much? will ask you. They're, they're, they think they're going to spit game. Like, oh, oh, hey. Did you know why? What They give you trivia. Oh, they, do you know what copper, right? Yeah. <laughs> what do, do you know why they call police cops? Yeah? Yeah. Why? Was? It's because their badge. Shout out to the fallen officers everywhere. Used to be made of <laughs> copper. Oh. So they call them cops as slang. Wow, the really? The fuck do you think I am? Of course I know that. Uh. <laughs> that's, not like, that's not like now. You're right. You know, uh. they're literally called coppers, right? Mm. Yep. Come yeah. on. And some kids, they just third their name are copper. Can you imagine? Yep. Copper was the name of the dog on Fox and the Hound. Copper? What other, copper. What other uh, periodic table names are out there? Iron. Iron? Oh, mm-hmm. yeah. Huh? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's Sodium? Nice. So did he made a Saudi? Was he Asian? Uh, no, I actually, well, kind of. I, well, he was Malaysian, so yes. Malaysian, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> he, I couldn't find him anymore, though. He, he was on that flight. Uh, so uh, potassium. Oh, you got a potassium? I've met a potassium. Damn, dude. What else? Have you anything in the Catholic community? Any names? Mm, not that I know. What other elements uh, is there, Hoss? Uranium? Car- carbon? You know what I mean? A little uranium dude, in their house? The Latinos think we have carbon, but they yeah. say cabron. Cabr- they, yeah, we switch they, dude, a couple letters about, around. Yeah. That's yeah. Alice that spelled it out. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> she got the B and the R fucked up a little bit. What happened, host? You know what I mean? Uranium? <laughs> Swapped a couple of the... Yeah. <laughs> That's what R. Kelly likes. <laughs> Do we even know that many elements? I mean, you know a lot of elements. So, but I'm talking about what other. I we're talking about the made. periodic. Chemistry was my worst science class yeah. in all. Yeah, it really was. Damn. I was the chemistry was easily my worst science class. Yeah, and some oh, titanium. You know hi- oh hydrogen. damn! Look at Harvey. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, there's hydrogen. There's hydrogen, oxygen. Oxygen. That's yeah. all on the carbon the table, right? Yep. Helium. There you go. Mm-hmm. Oh, helium, huh? Yep. I said there's iron. There's potassium, sodium, chlorides. Viltrumite. Viltrumite. Carbon. <laughs> Viltrumite. <Yeah. laughs> K.O. Kens. <laughs> a couple of K.O. Kens. Kens. Is there a or not? Huh? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> They're lurking in the background. <laughs> Uranium is another one. Oh, yeah. I think you already said that. Yeah. Uh, plutonium. Plutonium. Oh, remember that one always sounded cool. Like, oh. Yeah. Hey, pull up some plutonium. Remember how cool that looked? It was Like, cool. back then, you're like, dude. But if you stick your finger in plutonium, your whole body. Mer- mercury is another mercury. one. Mercury. Oh, yeah. that was another one. The table, but pull it up in uh like in uh in YouTube. Remember they would do that. Man, you got some plutonium there, bro. Man, things used to be so much cooler back in the day. Oh, is this a game? No, I mean, like plutonium. Uh, look at that. See, it's so deadly. Remember that? Look at that, man. Yep. Lead. Lead is another one. How many gloves? I guess does maybe he I knew have? more than I thought. And then, you know, and look, they're using latex gloves. You know, back in the day, because I was 11 years ago, you think this guy's going to have a latex energy? No. Allergy? But look at that, man. But what are you even, scroll down a little bit? Look how he's holding it. Let's see what it does to you a little bit, Hose, or no? Yeah, let's go ahead and see it. Nice. As you guys know, uranium is known as the most dangerous on Earth. And we've made a video. This is uranium, not plutonium, the but... <clears throat> another element that's pull it up put it up a little bit how you people by the name of plutonium uranium can be found in you still nature, a little bit more but you can't find plutonium in nature because it's man-made oh man-made look plutonium at look at that horse you see different elements that have been discovered in this year or that year. can you go on but the bottom on the time stamps where it says why it's dangerous it was made in 1940. Yeah, right there. As you guys know, uranium atomic number is 92. That's when I was born. Oh, look at that, huh? Plutonium, which has an atomic number of 94. 
but the uranium that turns into plutonium is uranium-238. If we want to put it in simple terms, it's basically uranium-238 capturing neutron and turning oh. into plutonium-239. It's a catfish, basically, huh? Plutonium is a very dense it's a filter. And hard metal. Machining this type of metal is extremely hard because it's such a stiff metal that it breaks easily. Oh, it's not even that cool. No, that wasn't that cool, dude. They saw it, dude. That was fake news. They made it sound like it was us. the future. Maybe, oh, plutonium. Maybe uranium is the one we we're thinking of. Well, they used uranium to make this, apparently. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. But what was other cool things that they would say, oh, they made this. Remember, Hoss? Oh, and they made the it... waffle maker. Remember that? When they yeah. used to... Oh. You remember the robotic dogs that they used to have? <laughs> yeah, the ones that... They were always poodles. They would sit down. I and then the looked... eyes would be hearts, remember? They... Poodles are the ones that also look like beagles. You remember those ones? Because they had the triangly flop... the floppy ears. I don't remember the ones with the triangle ears. Mm. I just remember the ones with the square ones. But then, dude, those ones would always die so fast. Like, if you were <clears throat> white people, then you had to operate those. But if you gave it to a minority, we didn't know how to play with that toy. We've never seen electricity before. Yeah, but do you guys remember that? Because, like, they would be like, oh, you want to watch my dog? And, like, they would do all the weird commands. And then you would try to, the dog wouldn't even wake up. It would never work. The yeah. ice would never light I'd up. give it a bath and it would just drown. And it was, like, a hundred dollar dog. Sink to the bottom. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh, doggy paddle. No. What nothing. were those called? I don't remember what they're called. Yeah, but those ones is like I remember only my white friends always had them, and then they they gave me one for my. Oh, but then they also had them in Happy Meals. Remember? Yeah. Like the ghetto ones, like plastic ones, like oh you can get the little puppies and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And now they don't have that. You know how sad is it? Now they have Very real sad. dogs in the humane society. You know, making videos. Yeah. Being influencers. <laughs> you know. <laughs> but what dog could you be, host? If you could pick a dog. Like a breed of a dog. <clears throat> yeah, or maybe if you can breed, because we always do top threes. You know what I mean? Of course. If you're gonna take your top three dogs to make one dog, oh, and then shit. what's gonna be the name of your dog? You know. Oh, God. Um. And it's this is gonna be you, so you're gonna be this dog. This is tough for me because I, I like almost all bully breeds. Like they're cute. Oh, to really? Me. Yeah. Um, Dang, just boy. something about that droopy face. They look kind of sad, and they look mean, but they're very sweet. I mean, I have a boxer, so I'm gonna I'm gonna start with a boxer. And mine's a reverse brindle boxer. Oh, it's reverse, huh? Dang, reverse brindle, dude. yeah. Um. But what feature are you gonna take from it? Probably just the face, because I like the squishy face and the droopy ears, you see? Yeah. I like that. Um, Look right there when it smiles. Oh, that's yeah, nice. That's cute, yeah. Mine looks like that. Uh, well, but she's black. Um, African-American, guys, okay? I can say that, because I'm Puerto Rican. Uh, shit. I'm trying to think of the different... Maybe... <clears throat> just so I don't have to worry, because boxers don't do well in the cold, because they're short-haired dogs. The Great Pyrenees... Oh, that one's cool. It's not the one that likes to play with fire. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> You're thinking of the pyro. The pyro. Technique. Yeah. Oh dang! Look at that. That one's nice. Let's yeah. look at that one, huh? Yeah. Aren't these like super aggressive, or am I oh. tripping? They're just not great, the Javi. Come on, no, man. The ones I've met are very kind. Very. I've seen one of a couple of those at the park. Her name's Courtney. <laughs> Is that not your neighbor? <laughs> 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 no, what was my neighbor saying? That was also Courtney, huh? Yeah. Damn, dude. <laughs> no, but the dog's name's Courtney. Yeah. So I think that would be the body of it, like so with the hair and stuff yeah, like that. Just to make just sure that, I don't have to. Oh, yeah, that would look funny. But with the cute face, and then look at that puppy man at the top. Oh, that one's yeah. nice. Oh, let's look at that. But it would have the face of the other dog. And then, can I pick a? Does it have to be a physical trait dog. or can it be a personality? Because I want the personality in the face of the boxer, the body of the Great Pyrenees. Okay. And then maybe. The instincts of what are they called? The pointer dogs? I forget the name. Type pointer dog. I'll know which one it is when I see it. Yeah, those ones. Oh, it's gonna go like that. They're like excellent hunting dogs. Oh, dang. Because my dog, my boxer would be awful at hunting. Horrific at hunting. These dogs are like very in tune with hunting and stuff. So I'd want that like instinct to hunt. Oh, that one's pretty cool. Also, they, they literally do that stance. Huh? Look yeah, at that. and they're oh, they're good is... dogs. I love those dogs. Dang boy. Pretty cool. That would be a good mix with a boxer, actually. I think so. You can call it a pointer boxer. Yeah, do pointer do uh, boxer mix. I want to see if it exists. It has. So you know a couple of Mexicans got a couple of these. Oh, probably. <laughs> <laughs> see? Kind of, right? It's like, just like an extra slim. An extra chromosome. Yeah. You were gonna say, oh, <laughs> this one looks like. <laughs> yeah, that's a good mix between the two. It's like more slender. I was going to say, that one over there on the left. 
where it says pet finder that one's cute yeah he's cute very cute but yeah that would be my dog that would be or mine. i guess me you know which dogs would you have javi and don't say a husky okay because we already no. know your we history know you, you wouldn't last too long you know what i mean <laughs> javi would not last Brooklyn. too long Uh, I'd probably do a bulldog. I like bulldogs. But which one are you gonna get? A American, French one? Are you gonna get an American, bull- Mexican bulldog? Um, a regular one, like that. A regular one, yeah. A bull- uh, like a. This is English, right? English bulldog, yeah. yeah. Dang. I didn't know they had Mexican ones. And host the royal, the <laughs> royal family, they have those uh, English bulldogs. Or no? I think they do. Yeah. Yeah. I want the chunkiness of it, like, I like their face too, but. It looks like a little Polynesian, a little bit. If you look at it, at Javi. Well, I think all of my Polynesian friends have see? one of these. Yeah, so it makes sense. Go back a little bit. Watch uh, down there. See? Uh, Which one? This one? <laughs> see? <laughs> when they're playing rugby. <laughs> 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 you know? Oh, and, and then go up. Look at that one. The one when that one they do some time holes. You know, when they just come back from the mission. Go up, go down a little bit, Javi. Right there, you see. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one that they, they, the first they got the ward, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Before America gets to them. Well, I mean, Ameri- I love American oh, Bulldogs. Oh, that's a good one right there. Look oh, at that one. I, I love American Bulldogs. They're so oh, that's cute. That's a nice one. Huh? Look at that. And they always seem pretty happy. You know what I mean? They're, American. If you treat them right, they're very <clears throat> sweet dogs. Yeah. I... But you're singing with the English. Yeah. Oh, that oh, massive like Hulk? beast. The size of this guy. Yeah, you're like, a massive bulldog like this? <laughs> oh Come God. on. That'd be so cool. I mean, Dude, Hulk was so cool <laughs> when he was alive. Remember how cool he was? He was <clears throat> everywhere. Yeah. And he had a big-ass chain, the gold chain. Yeah. Damn, that's who, and Hoodie Jerk gave me this fucking chain. Come on. <laughs> he has a bigger chain. Dude, Hulk has a bigger chain than me, Hoodie. Come on, give me a big chain, man. I want one like Hulk. You don't think so? I think so. Maybe next year if I deserve it. You know. <laughs> oh, but that picture. Look at the picnic with Hulk. That would be nice, huh? Yeah, imagine. Yeah. Maybe it, I would hang out with Javi now. You know what I mean? If you had to like that. <laughs> I, I can't imagine. I would Dude, and he would put him in the Escalade. Oh, that would oh. be cool. Same thing. Sit in the back of the Hulk. Yeah, you'd have to train you put Hulk in the. She front? already does. Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> with all the kids. You going to the dog? She's house. a chaperone. You know. Dude, and Hulk is in the front. Oh, yeah. Man. I don't know about the last one. I don't know what it. It could even be personality, you know, like Colts was saying, if you don't want to mix it too Yeah, much. I don't know. What, what's a good... Maybe a hound dog? Oh, I like hounds. Honestly, there's not very many dogs I don't like. Oh, what kind of dog are you making? <laughs> oh, just the personality of that. Yeah, just like... They're goofy. They're kind of goofy, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, yeah. They're chill. They're very chill. Or maybe a... I mean, maybe since it's a bulldog is already lazy, I take a beagle. Oh, I like beagles are super Yeah, cute. because... They're they're more energetic and stuff, and they're kind of everywhere. But I think so. I you guys that. remember the story Shiloh? Oh yeah, the yeah. movie. That was a movie, huh? Yep, too. Shiloh. I forgot it was a about book, that. and I read the book, yeah. and then they had the movie. That's a good name, Shiloh. Huh? Shiloh's a great book. Yeah, it's a Jewish, you know. So shout out to Shiloh Buff. You know what I mean? <laughs> well, that's it. That was that was mine. And we're still recording. We didn't press space too much or anything like that. No, we're good. Okay, so I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna start with Balto. Come on, boy. I'm gonna have that instinct. I'm gonna be able to push a sleigh. What kind of dog was that guy? He's like a wolf uh, he's dog half wolf. mix. He's yeah. half wolf. Click on the Wikipedia and see what it says, but I know he's half wolf. Oh, not that one. How many could have t- the other? Okay. That, the same so one he's an Alaskan Husky. Oh, maybe he was just an Alaskan Husky. I thought he was half wolf. So you want Alaskan Husky. Those crazy dogs. Can you put up? Let's pull up real <laughs> pictures of Balto. When you, can you go back, Javi? Isn't this one of them? Yeah, but that one doesn't. Okay, there you go. And Cute. look at that, huh? Uh, he's gonna save he some looks, kids. He looks like a little wolf, huh? Yep. He brought the COVID vaccine oh, to cool the kids. Color. Oh, yep. come on, so, boy! He's that original freaking uh, Moderna right there. Yeah, you know a, what I mean? <laughs> that's Big Pharma right there. <laughs> <laughs> that's Big Pharma. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's Pfizer. <laughs> that's just someone that can't say farmer. Uh, big Pharma. <laughs> big Pharma and little Pfizer right farmer. there. You know what I mean, dude? I didn't know he had a little paw like that. Looking. That's Johnson and Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> That's JJ right there. Yeah. That's only that one header, huh? Nah. I didn't know he had one leg. That's kind of cool. He has like a sock. Oh, he's a statue. Look at that, man. They, they taxidermied him. They did? Yeah, that's that's, wow. that's actually Balto. That is Fuck. so fucking cool, man. God. 
You probably have to visit the actual. Maybe website. one of you can take me there to the museum also. Go to see the Balto statue in Alaska. Maybe that's the only thing in the whole town <laughs> is the Balto statue yeah. and a bunch of needles. I can kind of see him there. Oh damn, that's so cool. He's a dope dog. He's actually a good looking dog. Look huh? at him. He's got a big heart. Yeah, yeah, yeah it is, yeah. huh? Dang, that's a Lord Slab right there, huh? Oh, that's the Lord Slab. So I'm gonna pick him, but then I'm gonna mix him. Let's see, because now I can do that stuff. I can be like a hero, you know? Mm -hmm. And then, uh, so he's already got good skills of like how to travel. But then I'm also going to mix him with another top doc, McGruff. Pull him up, Javi, okay? <laughs> We're going to give him the instinct of McGruff the so he can grunt. investigate. Oh, dude, man, you can't commit any, <laughs> Come on, man. You can't commit any felonies around <laughs> this dude. <laughs> He'll get you. So it's Balto. And then, look at this, dude. He wears suits like this. Oh, come on. If Balto is wearing a suit like he's this. He's always ready for the rain. And he <laughs> has one of those little search bars, Javi. What are they called? Over his eye? A magnifying glass. <laughs> <Yeah. device. laughs> <A> search bar. <laughs> He's going to those. Dude, uh, the reason he has a he's, he's a fucker. Look at that, dude, huh? He backs the blue one. Dude, the yeah, he's, dude. And you can see Balto with a couple brothers. Look it up, homie. Let's see. McGruff in the in the hood. Let me pull it up. Dude, <laughs> dude he's probably been there a couple times. With, you know, what do you think he gets his uh, perpetrator? You know? <laughs> Let's see if we can catch him. We got to get McGruff on Diddy, honestly. You know what I mean? He has to do the documentary. That's why he doesn't exist anymore. Diddy got rid of him. All right, there's a couple brothers right there, you think, Javi, or where? <laughs> right here. Ah. This is AI generated. Oh, okay. <laughs> when you see people doing crime, scroll up. <laughs> <Where>? <laughs> to the left, right there. <laughs> Can we watch it? Yeah, go ahead and watch it. Where's the sound? Oh. Ah, king, 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 king. Oh, you tap it. Drip, splash, water, drip, splash. Yeah, that Come doesn't on, make man. any sense. But yeah, McGruff. Maybe go back to just the original McGruff. I guess he's, he hasn't been in the hood that much. You know what I mean? It's because he moved up. Look at that, man. He's so freaking dope. You know what he, I mean? Him and Armando Armani. Can you imagine both of them just he, like on a case? He's a private investigator now. Or bro, they would. Look at that. Look at that. Look, they have him with the president, dude. He met the president. Look at that. Come on. Yeah, he doesn't have to be in the hood anymore. What the dude, hell? Yeah, he's in the White House. You know what I mean? Yeah, we know how the war on crime turned out, though. So some, maybe he's not that good of a dog. Some, hey, host, come That's why he's got Balto traits, too. You know? <laughs> Balto? He's, he's probably the one that found the cocaine. In yeah. the <laughs> and then just to neutralize Hobby's fucking threat with fucking Hulk, Clifford the Big Red Dog. <laughs> pull him up, Hobby. Clifford the Big Red Dog, okay? Look at that, huh? <laughs> what do you think Hulk's going to do? You, dude, well, right, dude, I'll get on top of my dog. Look at that, huh? Actual size right here. <laughs> look at that. Look how big, huh? Dude, some people... Doesn't he kind of look like he's got an extra chromosome right there? <laughs> <laughs> like a little bit? <laughs> look at him. You know, but he's going to be he that He looks like tall. he's down for anything. <laughs> <laughs> so, mine's... Can you imagine, us? And he's that <laughs> tall? Dude, come on. Do you think the World Trade Center would fall, Hoss? Oh, not With my him. dog out there <laughs> in New York City? He oh, would have yeah. picked it up real quick. You know? Patrolling, yeah. dude. He would have snatched the plane. He would have just in midair. You know what I mean, Hoss? Of course. That Boeing, you know? That plane's nothing but a bird to him. Yeah, that's yeah. a lot. That's what I would... I think that's what I would do. That would be pretty nice. You don't think my, it would be pretty nice, huh? So I, had a, I think so. Would you let mine hang out with your dog? Of or? course. Yeah. yeah. You don't think it would be scared? Maybe I made my dog too big. But they're friendly. Oh, like and my that. dog's not going to be a felon, so the McGruff side, yeah. it's not going to matter. <laughs> <laughs> That's how we spot, like, if we're doing bad business, you know? Yeah. <laughs> we just send McGruff in. You, know? <laughs> <laughs> you send my fucking dog in. <laughs> <laughs> Are we good to go there? You know what I mean? You know? Yeah, that would be pretty nice, huh? Dude, we made pretty good dogs, honestly, man. I think so. Damn, boy, look at that. And Clifford, whatever happened to him, he kind of went extinct too, huh? Well, With public television, huh? He's red. <laughs> no, they're going to do the the remake, he's going to be blue, is what you're saying, huh? Yeah. <laughs> well, if the movie's going to come out, just make sure you make a reservation for it. Can you imagine if Biden, maybe that's what they need for President Biden, you know what I mean? Because he always forgets the name of his dog now. He's like Roger, or what the does he call his dog? I don't know. Roger. <laughs> I know he, he forgets like the name, you know. Yeah. Hey, uh, now I, I remember why you know. And how... it, it was Biden people at the White House, dude. You didn't know? <laughs> it probably got into the coke look, of look Hunter. Look it up really quick. I'll be like, uh, <laughs> President Biden's dog attacks or something like that. But it, <laughs> he got like a rescue. It's like a a German Shepherd. 
Oh, that's called an immigrant, bro. <laughs> There was a near incident on October 26, 2022 on White House grounds. The dog lunged to bite but missed before the First Lady regained control of the leash. Uh, November 2022 injury by the uh, dog to a uniformed division officer's right arm and right quad required treatment at a hospital. Commander, that's his name, see? He's named after a, fucking, after a Jeep fucking vehicle. Well, dude, but that dog bleeds blue. Yeah, in it's the, right here, uh, right yeah. there. Commander, look at him, bro. Hey, pull him up. Just Google Commander. Let's look him up, dude. That's like kind of a cool name, though. You don't think so? A little bit. Because, you know, Biden, he's a commander in chief, but, you know, Commander's actually the commander, you know? Look <laughs> he's got to fucking pull He's got a Wikipedia. <laughs> <laughs> he's not as cool as Bob. Look at that, dude. You think he's that cool? He looks like he did cocaine for a while. And, uh... Uh... <laughs> well, Hunter was probably taking him for a while. He looks like he's two years sober. He look, go up <laughs> look at that. Go here, boy. Oh, that's a nice lawn. Look at that horse. But yeah, he attacked. Can you believe that, Hoss? Unbelievable. Man, that would well, suck. You know and how... people are worried about Trump with uh, access to nukes. Oh, Come on, man. <laughs> He's got this Trump, dog. Trump, he didn't around. have a dog, huh? I don't think, I don't think so. so. Yeah, I he think... was the dog in the world. But you know how Biden uh, didn't have a Easter bunny this year? Yeah. Do you remember why? Because the last time he had one, they was telling him when what he to do. Lost? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, fuck that. I'm not having that anymore. <laughs> but yeah, that's why he didn't have one this year. Oh, really? He was sick of people being, telling him what to do. That is kind of cool, though, huh? If he was like, dude, fuck the Easter Bunny, you know? <laughs> <laughs> like, I fucking... That's his nemesis, you know what I mean? No, he's like, oh, fuck that, He has dude. a beef with a rabbit that lays eggs. <laughs> a fucking lame-ass president. Then you see each other across the White House, you know what I mean? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? That would be so cool, dude. Hey, look at that with the bunnies. But the rabbits are pretty cool, huh, Hoss? Look at that, man. Yeah, I like them. But did you see that? Oh, uh, look, dude, they're doing the right salute. Here. Oh, dude, that, that rabbit is a patron. Did you see that, Hoss? I want a rabbit uh, suit sometimes, man. I thought you said rabbit soup, and that is pretty good. Yeah, you had rabbit soup? Yeah. Well, I've had rabbit before, too. You've but had you it before. Yeah, but I didn't have soup. You said rabbit soup. Probably that's different. Didn't yeah, we've we already seen this one. How do you remember? We, we played it when it happened. Did we? Yeah. yeah. I was just reminding people. Oh, but that's a cool outfit, huh? Look yep. at that one. Dang, dude. He kind of looks like a rabbit. Go up a little bit. Look at it, Hoss. It's like frozen. They kind of look like they're twins. You don't think so? Yeah. That guy on the right, <laughs> if you see him next to the bunny. Isn't that from Urban he, Pond? Nah, Isn't that the guy? He looks a little bit like Hobby, don't you think? <laughs> you think so? Yeah, just a little bit. This guy right here? Zoom yeah. in a little bit. Oh, he does, Hoss. Zoom in a little bit. Dang, Hobby. Let's see. Take your hat off and smile. Oh, yeah, look at see, that, yeah. dude. <laughs> Maybe Avi was investigating the White House. Oh, yeah. He didn't even tell us that he went. Dude, and then they put like a sister in there with her covering her baby's face. Can you see that, Hoss? Look at that. That's weird, man. It's because it's a recording device. It's not even a baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's a giant, oh, it's a giant voodoo doll. <laughs> it's just like... Oh. Dang, that's pretty cool, huh? Maybe yeah. I want to see the president, man. It would be cool. You don't think so, Hoss? No. You don't want to see a president at the White House like that by the fence? <laughs> what? <laughs> Not Biden. <laughs> that one's typing like that. Dude. It's uh, doing it's TikTok and stuff like that. Well, it's it's up, doing TikTok in the White House, it's, even though it's, it's bad. It's uploading to OnlyFans. That's what it looks like. But what are we in time, hubby? 48. 48 on the lake. Shout out. <laughs> we still got our pay-per-view out. 48 on the lake. You can buy it. VOD available. Where else? UtahRapper.com. Um, okay. Heat check. Whoa. Okay, and then you guys can nominate who you who sent you there. You guys can put us. Yeah, beans and rice. Yeah, don't put one of the rappers. You know what I mean? They don't deserve. They you don't even know who they are. You know, but you know us a little bit. You know what I mean? Yeah, Host? you're listening to us. We would imagine you would know who we are. So we can do that. But I think now, should we spin the wheel, or do we want to celebrate any holidays? You think, Hoss? Maybe to, we can we celebrate the holidays. Yeah, because we haven't celebrated the holidays for a long time. You know, not by ourselves. We have with oh. guests. The guests, you think they know how to celebrate holidays? They don't know how to celebrate. Dude, they don't even have hobbies. So do you think so? That's do they have they, QuickBooks? That's why they come here to begin <laughs> you with. Know? You know? Yeah. Look at that national ferret. What is that? Isn't that the chocolate? Yep. Ferrero Rocher. <laughs> <laughs> Ferrero Rocher. You know? That's all Mexican. Ferrero Rocher is like an Asian trying to say something they can't. Yeah. <laughs> Ferrero Rocher. <laughs> Dude, a ferret is like a Mexican lady. You know, she's at work and a white lady. Hey, how's it going, Maria? Maria, how are you doing? I have a ferret that I want to give you. And then like, 
The Mexican Lady gets home. Ay, viejo. Me dijo la señora Lindsay. Me dijo mi manager Lindsay que me, que me iba a dar un Ferrari. Me trajo unos chocolates. Que, que me va a regalar un, Ferra, un Ferrari o un, un Ferrari. ¿Cómo se dice? El, el, así, el, uh, un chocolate. Ferrero Rocher. Boom, boom. Dile que sí, dile que sí, que te lo dé. You know? So then he lets the boss son know. Caros. Yeah, son, caros. son caros. Están bien bonitos. You know? Bien lujosos. Yeah. And because she tells the kids, yeah, it's like, who says no use those uh, Ferraris? Ferraris? So the kids are like, oh, yeah. mom, you're, and then the kids are like, oh, yes, yes, sí. Mama, let's not get out of Ferrari, mama, you know? So she texts the boss, I'll take it, you know? Me dieron un ratón. She gets, <laughs> and it's that fucking cage yeah. of ferrets, you know what I mean? Is it me or do ferrets just look like raccoons with Down syndrome? A little yeah. bit, yeah. <laughs> well, they look cute, though. Oh, yeah, Down Syndrome oh. look cute. Shout out to my uncle, R.I.P. But he looks, look, oh, he looks look like look at that raccoon. one, the third one. Look how he's, like, in there in the warmth. Look at that one. That's cute. Yep. He's, he's smiling. smiling. Yeah. You know, but that... <laughs> did that ever happen to your family? Like, when they got stuck with, like, a weird fucking abandoned pet? <laughs> Dude, okay? I'll tell you guys this. <laughs> I had, like, a, a couple, like, I think my pills for seizures, right? And then, um... So I already take that as, as a kid, right? When I was younger. And then one of the uh, people that lives in the neighborhood, they had like a fucking poodle, right? And like the same thing, oh, it's a poodle. And they and, and Mexicans always say, es de marca, you know, because it's not a fucking mix. Like, oh, es de marca. Es un poodle, es original, you know? <laughs> Dude, they gave my mom this fucking poodle. She brings it home. It's got like 10 fucking medicines. So they had seizures, they had diabetes, <laughs> you know? <laughs> And they had like a pill pocket, a pill pouch, diapers for it just in case. I'm like, bro, like, you know, it's like, <laughs> yeah. how did you even take this dog? I don't even know what happened to it. Dude. That ointment for open wounds. <laughs> yeah. But did your parents ever take like something like that? Or it could have been like my microwave, you know? Yeah. Or like a weird thing that somebody didn't want a couch anymore. No, my parents were always cautious <laughs> about like things that were given to them. So yeah, unless they trusted the person, they weren't going to take anything. But even something that maybe that you hated. Or maybe they got this weird couch that you hated the couch or something that you... I'm trying to think. I can't think of anything. Honestly. Or even a toy or a certain like a, like a pressure cooker or something like that. No, or something. Okay, maybe if you didn't get something weird, maybe... Tupperware, man. Uh, I hated it. There's, I'd open they up would the give you fucking the garnet and it would fucking all fall. No, like the cheap plastic ones. Oh, and then it would still Until smell like the old people's. Yeah, and then it was all burnt on the inside and it had like melted parts, so... I was happy when we got the glass Pyrex. Oh, yeah. What about you, Javi? Could you remember something like that? That they gave you guys, oh, here's the, uh, you know, this is so nice. Weren't the couches, like, all g given to us? I don't know. Maybe oh, the old house, no? Yeah, the old house. That's the bottom ones? Yeah. We just kind of... In the basement? Yeah. Yeah, but you know, one thing that I hated, bro, we always get those weird shaped couches. Like, what's the deal with mom? Like they're all <laughs> It's like old style Try to find whatever fucking couch this is Victorian. It's like Victorian couch or some shit bro But it's like All the Mexicans have these fucking couches Yeah man. dude Every fucking Mexican And they're not these ones No, no. They're like uh... Just do Victorian style Instead of just See if that comes up Cause these are nice ones Like uh... Uh, These are too nice Maybe we just look up regular couches Put Mexican couches, maybe. <laughs> Literally, Mexican. This is the. the it's kind of like that, no? A little bit? No. But with cushions? It's oh, right there, that, homie. It's that one. Yeah. Look, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> it's been through the centuries, bro. It's not yeah, even. <laughs> so they'll literally have a couch that looks exactly like that, bro. They'll be like, they're made out of like different like uh, materials, something and stuff like that, but that's like. Every dude, since we were kids, like, look, all of them are right there, obviously. All of, this. <laughs> all of those, dude. But they were never, like... Dude, that's the one we had at the downstairs, that one, obviously. Look, one? that's the one. Remember when I have a picture where I'm re when I'm under the couch and I'm grabbing from yeah, under he you? Hid, he hid under the, the, mat, the nets. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like I would sticking. snatch people that would sit down. Cause it was, dude, it went so deep. The back, it was Narnia. Yeah. Oh, it's, bro, the yeah. back of the couch, you could fit Imagine two Mexicans him, in there. Him just fucking... Uh, Laid out underneath, like he in, still had plenty of room back. for That's another funny. person. So people could still sit there, and then I would just like grab him and try to snatch him into the underworld. But dude, she always has these couches, hoes. And like, 
they all look like just like variations of this dude and i'm not gonna lie they're fucking ugly bro yeah it's like this one's like a yeah lot of this. like that it's like bro they're so ugly that's like the one thing that always surprises me yeah. like dude how, the new ones that are in the other living room those are nice yeah, yeah. like now she finally got some like more now like, she's now she's upgraded to a sectional oh really so, yeah so yeah because the ones in the other room like those ones i like but those like they don't even use as the main living room couches Cause they're not like the cool Mexican ones, you know. Cause they're actually pretty nice. Yeah, yeah. And those ones are nice. Those are like really nice. I wanted those couches. I was trying to get them over here. Yeah. You, know? <laughs> you were trying to get the gift. You, know? <laughs> you didn't, you know, give me a nice couch. But yeah, but that's the. Uh... That was my thing. Like the couches that we always uh, somehow fucking had. Like, and sometimes they always. That's a bad thing. You get a hand me down, like. Clothes, okay, they'll wash away, you know what I mean? But sure. then you got something like that where then your house smells like the last person. Yeah. And they, their smell for the last 10, 20 years is there. Yeah. You can't just, like, wipe it, you know? So then, like, you, you walk in there. You can't deep clean it. You have to, like, pressure yeah. wash it, like, 50 times before you can even to smell the shit out. Yeah. yeah. And sometimes, like, the worst one was, like, okay, you got it from a Mexican. Maybe it was your family. Okay, you knew they maybe they ate a lot of pozole. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But then maybe the Smiths give you their couch and it has a white people smell that you're not accustomed to. <laughs> Remember us? You walk in and it just smells like like dirty library with like candle and uh, you know and pumpkin and stuff like that. It you're, and like baking. It smells like you people know? know how to read. <laughs> <laughs> and people that love desserts. Yeah, like a lot of baking. Well, it's like <laughs> you get one of those couches and it's like so hard because the smell is almost like tangy. You know, yeah. when it hits your nose, it's like stale but still put like putrid almost. Javi, can you look up why do white people smell tangy? Maybe see if it tells us. Tangy? Tangy. T A N G. A tang, like orangutan. Like the orange juice tang. Uh, with people the y. smell. Y. Tang Y. Yeah, they have a weird smell, man. Look at that, see? <laughs> <laughs> a couple brothers were out in Quora, you know what I mean, host? I <laughs> do. So, why do white people sound? Tell me, white people are weird. Look at that, see? No, no. You want to go on Reddit? No, that one wanna... says, why do white people go down? It said on Reddit, too. Why do white people smell yeah. like. Yeah. Bodega Boys. Shout out to the Bodega Boys. That's no, right. that's no, not the right back. one, Javi. Second, uh, up that one. Yep. The comments about other racist smell sadly. Said white people stink. For the record, he said white people smell like basement. <laughs> <laughs> Like in the bed. It is all like yeah. musty, like fucking attic, <laughs> like that, dude. That's why it's I said like stale. basement, that, attic. Said smell, yeah. yeah. Uh, God. Been told by a black student I'm the only white person he's met that always smells, smells good. good. See? But I've switched schools. I'm super self conscious about uh, smells because of my upbringing. Upbringing. Grew up in a hoarder house. Okay. That's what they smell like, hoarder yeah, too. Yeah. You know. My husband said it's because they're not used to white people. Uh, is this true? How do I address? Okay. Basement. No. That might be the best uh, yeah. description. The white busted. people smell like, like basement? Myth busted. busted. They busted it first, but we re-busted it just in case, you know? Myth musted. Yeah. Okay? That's just what they smell like. God, it is so weird, huh? Yeah. I wonder what they, if, because white people, they don't say stuff when they come into, you know, our, our places where we dwell. They're like, oh, it smells like fiesta. It smells good. I've heard yeah. uh, mom's house, or whose house? Somebody's house, like, that. somebody came over and was like, oh, this house is so Mexican. It smells so Mexican. I was like, I don't know what that means. Oh, really? Yeah. Maybe were they cooking beans and stuff like that? Maybe. Or salsa or picos. Yeah, that we were heating up and stuff. Yeah, because that know. does sometimes stink. You know, you're cooking something ethnic a little bit, Jose, yeah. and But it doesn't always smell like that. You clean, right? You're using fabuloso. But then you become nose blind to your own place, right? That is so true. I don't know. Yeah. I don't that know. That is true. Do we smell? We just got to get uh, other minorities. To... We got to ask everybody that shows up, hey, how does it smell in I here? Mexican <laughs> houses smell different than... Than what like it's always different to me when I walk in. Okay, I got a patent pending. We're gonna sell uh what would we call it? Basically we go to like a Mexican house, right? And we bottle the air. Capture that scent. Put it in a in a bottle mm-hmm. and then we sell it so we can go African, you know, we can go Asian community now. You know what I mean? Yep. Now we can go to the Mongolians, you know, we can go to the Africans. So we can but what would we call it? We go scoop the air and then it's like ethnic <laughs> cleansing. Or ethnic air. What about ethnic air? <laughs> ethnic cleansing? 
Dude, but then yeah, there would be cleansing. cleansing your own. Yeah, of and course. Then, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? You're bringing other races into. You're being more <laughs> inclusive. We. That's how we end racism. Dude, <laughs> yeah, that's the white people that walk. I am not racist. Look at my <laughs> ethnic cleanse. <laughs> I have Ethiopia right here. <laughs> you want to smell? Yeah. I don't know. Dude, <clears throat> you're like the the Mangualas are coming. You know what I mean? Got the Ethiopian air. You know? You just open all your jars and just like throw it in there. Doctor Bosch shows up. Yeah. How does he? What does he say as soon as he walks in? Oh, this place smells very good. <laughs> <laughs> it smells like a home. <laughs> oh, we might have to hit the call center, dude. I think we might have to hit the call center. Oh, shit. We have to sell. Do you think you can sell us some hus? Perhaps some ethnic air. Is that what we're yeah. gonna call it? I mean, what do you guys want to call it? What ethnic else? air, or what was it called? Ethnic cleansing, or what was it called? Either one sounds good to me. Ethnic air is pretty cool too. Right? Yeah, ethnic air. <laughs> it sounds like an airline. airline yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or ethnic aromas. Yeah, I don't know. That's a because ethnic cleansing. That means that's almost like what Hitler said. I think yeah. you know yeah, what I'm saying. It's exactly <laughs> what Hitler said. <laughs> Which was my point exactly. <laughs> oh, come on, homie. Ethnic sense. I didn't say Jewish. I, ethnic no one sense. Said Jew- yeah. Ethnic sense. Yeah. That's ethnic sense. Pat and pending. pending. Oh, come on, dude. We're going to be trillionaires now. <laughs> Let's come on, dude. And we're going to stop racism. Yeah. Dude, all dude, finally, one. America was like, bro, put us in But money. money comes first, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I gotta, we got to set ourselves straight For the here. right price. Yeah. Mark Cuban. Eth- <laughs> Well, Shark Tank, again? here we come. Uh, <laughs> ethnic sense. Ethnic sense. Oh, damn, that is so good, dude. You, is the call center headset right here, or do we have to use the green one? I call center is one. all camera, right? Yeah. And it has it there at the bottom. I don't see one. Not even the green one's on there? Uh oh. Oh, the green one's right here. Yeah. Okay, so maybe what kind of customer should I be, you think, Klaus? What, com- what community can you be from? <laughs> you want to be a Russian? Huh? You want to be Russian? I don't know how to talk or, do you, or do you want to be just a... a you want to be a representative Turkish the community? You should be Turkish. Turkish? Turkish? But maybe he, maybe he might have a point, I might have to be white. Because they're the ones yeah. that people always say are culturally ignorant. Okay. So they yeah. need the most. Okay, I can be They'll quiet. be our biggest customers. True. A Puritan? <laughs> <laughs> Quaker of me. <laughs> Quaker? <laughs> heary, heary. <laughs> Oh, not yet, huh? Not yet. No, not yet. We haven't even called the call center, Howie. Come on, man. It's okay. I thought we were behind the scenes. At... <laughs> no, the call center is like, how are we going Behind the scenes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let me see. So what could my name... Uh, oh, okay. Smells like Morocco. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there you go. Uh, let's see. Um, cocaine and... <coughs> yeah. And opioids. <laughs> oh, that was pretty strong, huh? So let's see. My name's going to be... What's a white name, man? Thomas is pretty white, right? They have a lot Jeremy. Of Jeremy, okay. <laughs> I'll be Jeremy. Maybe I'll be Jeremy McBride. Okay. Huh? <laughs> it's, it's pretty, that's as white as it comes. <laughs> you don't think so, Jeremy McBride? Yeah. Okay, and Javi, he's like, uh, what could Javi be, you, th- you think? Is he going to call with you? Maybe he can be like, maybe he's like my co-worker or something like that. And he's like telling me that I smell weird or something like that, right? Maybe. Or he could be my boss where I have to run specials through him. Like if I'm going to make a one-time deal just to get the sale. <laughs> oh, you get, you have to place me on hold? Yeah. Okay. So I have to talk to Javi when I place him on hold. Hey, Jeremy McBride, what's going to be your name, Javi? What's a good boss name? Max Powers, like Homer, but what's something powerful? I mean, Gregory's pretty good, right? But if he's going to be ethnic, it has to be something like... Uh... Roberto. Roberto? Roberto? Yeah. And the last name? Villalobos. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, Roberto There's Villalobos. We were listening to that earlier. Yeah. That's why I thought of Villalobos. Jeremy McBride. Okay, let's go.
Roberto Villalobos del Monte. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to get taxidermied after I <laughs> fucking kill him. <laughs> Se parece a Balto. Because <laughs> he looks like a little bitch. <laughs> y ya estoy alto de sus mentiras. Okay, so I'm going to call him and see. Oh, dude, we lost all our phones. Come on, man. Did, did fucking Augustus take our fucking trap phones? He took all of them. Hey, Augustus, come on, Hit man. me on my trap phone. <laughs> he trapped our phones and took it with him. Yeah. Well, they're all right here, actually. <laughs> <laughs> False accusation. <laughs> Just because he's bro. a minority. He's a <laughs> this is why you need ethnic sense, okay? So we can get rid of some of this. Uh, hey, you're playing too much into that Jeremy McBride role. <laughs> <laughs> Jose's, uh, what is that? Method actor? Uh-huh. Jose's a method actor. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he's racist only when he's acting. <laughs> Okay, so let me see. So I'm going to call. But see, I have to be having some dialogue with somebody before I call. Does that make sense? But then you have to have a dialogue with him. You have to play double duty. Okay, so however, you're just like my, uh, your ethnic friend. You're you're going to invite me to a cookout. You know what I mean? A cookout? Maybe or you're Maurice. Maybe, maybe a dinner because you're going to invite me to the barbecue. Maurice? Big Mo. I'm Polynesian. <laughs> yeah, you want. Big Mo. <laughs> hey, brother. <laughs> You want to come to my cookout? <laughs> okay, play some Polynesian so music really quick. <laughs> Go play a uh, Polynesian music. We have a uh... reggae. No, 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 because we're gonna get flagged. What is the other stuff? Uh, ukulele. You yeah, know, just uh-huh. ukulele music. Oh, uh, how do you spell yuka? Ukulele. <laughs> ukulele music. Maybe one that we don't get. Uh, like that, maybe right? You do, that seems like. <laughs> you know they're not doing shit, bro. You Dude, they mean? play this in Lilo and Stitch. <laughs> they do? <laughs> okay, put it up, honey. You can, you can still put it up more. Hey, it you're does gonna say buy on iTunes, so maybe we don't want to use this. Well, that's okay. You think so? I guess. Okay, you call me, hubby. <clears throat> ring, ring. Ring, ring. Hey, oh my god. It's... Hey, how's it going, Big Mo? Hey, Jeremy. Hey, how's it going, brother? Hey, big brother. Hey, I want to invite you to a uh, cookout at me house. Uh, wow. You're go- I've been wanting to go. Is this one of those things where you have the people with the fire? A luau? A luau? Wow. Yes. yes. Maureen is going to be thrilled when I tell her. No, no, no. Not Maureen. Just you. Just me? Yeah, I don't have enough food. Oh, I gotta uh, feed my whole family now. Uh, well, I don't know if Maurice. I mean, what they? You know, Maurice and I. We tell her it's a, it's a, it's a boys' night. You know. A, well, you know, I have to kind of tell With her the other stuff. You know, because she's been wanting to go. Umaga's gonna be there. You gonna, you gonna tell Umaga no? Well, what am I gonna tell Maurice? You know, she wanted to go to the dunes, right? We got the RV ready. It's been having a little bit of issues. Just but... tell her you're having quick drinks with the brothers. Oh God! Well, what day is it going to be, Mo? Let's go tonight. Come over tonight. Tonight? Oh, geez. Waiting Maybe... for tonight. Okay. Whoa. I will. I, you know, I'm gonna have to tell her. Maybe there's an emergency. Maybe one. Maybe your your cousins. Your one of your usos, right? Maybe my I can tell them all... my tocos. <laughs> one of your tocos. Because I'm both. I'm Samoan and well, <laughs> Tonga. Maybe, okay, I'm going to hang up and maybe say maybe that Tonu, that maybe he got, you know, his liver is malfunctioning or something. And I'll see if I can get Maureen to just let me go. I'm going to say that it's an emergency, okay? Whatever it takes, brother. Just hang up. I'm going to talk to Maureen really quick. And just, you know, just give me a call. Mahalo. Okay. I love you too, buddy. Okay. Now you're Maureen. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. So now we're <laughs> Everybody's playing double duty too. <laughs> hey, baby. Hi. Well, well, just the weather. You know, I, you know, work's been a little bit crazy lately. You I know? bet it has. Yeah, I mean, poor Mo's brother, you know, he, he might have to call in the next couple of days. He was telling me he was very ill. Can you believe that? I, I, I Oh, is that the Hawaiian folk? The Hawaiian guy. The oh, big one, the big, big Mo. Guy. You know, the one when he 
when oh. the truck goes sideways a little bit when we were the, talking about the tire the moana guy yes when it was balling on the left <gasps> side because he's so big oh you'll have to tell him you're welcome yes well they well i mean you know i don't want to be rude because it's a very serious topic you know but what's wrong with him he's been having you know he's a bigger guy you know does he have gout I was about you know, say. when in doubt, it's scout. I think what they say, right? But he's... is that a saying that they have on the islands? I'm not sure. I'm not you know, I want to go to Waikiki. You know, I want to go to Waikiki later yeah. for summer. Well, that's well, my spot. I'm working on I it. I want to work on my tan. I'm working on a bay, but it's just you know he might need me there for support. You know, uh, I want to go to one of their Lululemons. You know, when they put on the skirt, the grass skirt. Oh, those always sound nice. Yeah, is that what they're called, Lululemons? Well, maybe after his funeral, if something God forbid happens, maybe I can invite you to one. Okay. After I think they have a ceremony after, like a month after they pass away, they usually. And don't they play the violin like a guitar? I, no. I think instead of using the, you know, the bow? I am not familiar with that, honey. Okay. But I, I, he might be calling me anytime. Okay. Well, no, okay. But... You know we have dinner plans tonight, so don't eat a lot. I know they love to eat. Well, what do you mean eat? We're gonna go to dinner. Ring, We're ring. We're gonna go to dinner. Yeah. Hey, how's it going? Who's this? Jeremy, brother. It's me, <gasps> Big Mo. Tell them, tell them I love no. Lilo and Stitch. Well, hey, one second, babe. Hey, Mo. Hey, Lilo what's going on, man? Baby. What hey. happened to your brother, Mo? He's got a really crazy gout, brother. Oh, Maureen. Big Mo, his brother's he can't even get out very of bed. bad. He needs help. He can't get out of bed. He needs to get out of bed. Okay. And we need a crane. Oh, yeah. You, you need to go help your friend. Tell him, Merakaliki Maka Ohana for me. Oh, okay, I'll be there, Mo. Maureen is very understanding. We'll be there in a, in a bit, okay? All right. Sounds good, Let me brother. Let grab my you. Hawaiian I can, shirt. I can make them Hawaiian haystacks if it'll make them feel okay. better. Thank you. Okay, bye. Bye. I'm so worried. Okay, so now we're going. Okay, damn. Okay, so now it's getting interesting, right? So now I'm driving. And then... Uh... <clears throat> you want to present a gift to them because you don't know... You don't want to show up empty-handed. Well, he's going to tell me that I smell funny, right? Because oh, now I'm in the right. car, and he yep. has to tell me that I smell funny. That's right. Right? So now you have to... You call me again. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, you music. call me? Well, this is how I left Maureen stuff as. <laughs> ring, ring. Hey, Mo. Jeremy, brother, you coming there what? Hey, I'm on my way. You know, I just had to get rid of her. <laughs> oh, boo. My man, you know, my toko. You know it. I wore my favorite Polynesian shirt too, with the flowers and this guy. You know it's nice. Whoa! I'm excited about this. Hurry it up because the food is running low. Is brother. there anything I need to take? Whatever you want, whatever you want. Bring, bring whatever. You don't what? have to bring anything. I don't have to bring anything because no. sometimes when I'm at the office, you tell me that there's a weird vibe about me. Bring when some horse if you can find some. Some horse. Sometimes you complain about me smelling different, Mo. Is there anything that I could possibly do to fit in a little bit more with your culture? Hey, maybe stop buying those Hawaiian shirts from the DI, brother. <laughs> All right. you, you start smelling like... I know you. I know those missionaries. You know, love their okay, Hawaiian well, I'm shirts. I'm gonna lose a shirt, Mo. But is there anything else that I could possibly buy to enhance, <laughs> to enhance, to the enhance sandals. myself and my appearance for for the Usos and the Tokos? Hey, maybe there's something you could buy, some candles, something. I don't know. All it's... right, man. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna call. All right. Have a good day, man. I'm on my way. All right, brother. Oh my god. What a fucking dipshit. He's fucking. Pacific Island brain, it's just, you know, too bad. They're in an island for a reason, but let me go ahead and call really quick. What is this ad right here for scented air? It's, I'm just going to call a number. I can't see the name of the company that much. My, I forgot my reading glasses. God damn it. <laughs> All right, let me go ahead and call. This is a call center. Okay, let me go ahead and call the center. Call center host, how may I direct your call? Hey, how's it going? I just saw a little ad here uh, about some scented air. Oh, it sounds like it's a new division that we have added. It's called Ethnic Scents. Ethnic Scents, oh, wow. Yes. Is that exactly what you want to do? I saw something? it here on Instagram. You guys got an offer for 40 yards. Okay, I'll go ahead and transfer you to a specialist. Please hold as I get you connected. Thank you very much. Have a great day and thank you for calling Call Center Hosts.
Thank you for calling. This is Call Center Host here at Ethnic Sense. How may I be of service? Hey, how's it going, host? Uh, I'm just calling, you know, I got invited to a luau. It is a very big deal. Okay. Uh, I have a lot of Polynesian friends, and they complain sometime about my scent. I can see where you're coming from. I'm going to guess that you're a Caucasian male? Yes, I am American. Yes, sir. Proud American here. And it sounds like you've never Go been outside 46. of the, the 48 states of the U.S., correct? Well, you know, I haven't traveled there. Me and my, you know, my beautiful wife and I, we have a couple of kids. I've been planning, no, actually, I'll take that as a no. for the last couple of Worry times. Worry not. Take you said your name was Jeremy, sir. Trip. We're, yes, we're going to take this beautiful okay. trip. Sounds good. We're planning to I, go hold to on, hold on, la, 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 la. Okay, thank you, Jeremy. Yes, sir. You said you're going to a luau. It's a big deal for everyone that is white. It's not a big deal for anyone. You wouldn't take it that seriously. But I'm going to get you on the right track so that the Usos and the Tocos can get you into their brotherhood. Does that sound good to you? They have a brotherhood. Well, I think they're called TCGs. They're always saying that. TCG. TCG. Yep, trading card game. They do that a lot. Wow. They love Pokemon. They love Magic the Gathering and all other sort of collectible wow. card games. So let's go ahead and uh, get your account open. I have all your information here. Wow, uh, already? Yes, I don't think do. I've ever bought any products from you. Oh, we just pulled the information from your phone. Shout oh. out to TikTok. And <laughs> we, have, <laughs> we have this uh, Islander special. Okay? Yes, it's going to contain an assortment of scents wow. so that you can smell more at home in their home. What is the smell of this? Uh, well, it's got a bit of seaweed. They love the sea. They love seafood. Some uh, some teak wood because they uh, carve. They are great uh, woods craftsmen. They also have uh, <laughs> they have roasted pig and pineapple. You know, you've heard of haystacks before. I'm I sure. have heard of that, sir. Um, I do have. There is a. Uh, I'm looking here on the Instagram. It has Hawaiian carbon smell. Okay. Is that one? That's our recently uh, acquired uh, smell. They also have burnt aloha. It, that one's called smolder no more. Uh, yep. Charred. Charred wood. And was that one maybe, I try to, you know, they're a little bit bigger guys. So I just want something that's going to make me feel a little bit more powerful. Yep. The smoldering teak wood is probably what we're going to get you to. So we'll get you a, a candle. They run 24 ounces is our standard size. It's going to last you a long time. You burn time of about 36 hours. 36? You burn this? Yeah, you. it's a candle. You turn it on. Oh, by, I'm, I'm calling for the air. There's oh, just the air. You just want the spritz cans. Yes, I'm just, I just need to wear because it's just for the, I just need to go in there. I'm going to open a jar while I walk into them so they can s smell that well, I'm... Well, it's a spritzer, and there are packs of three, forty nine ninety nine. $49.99. $49.99? Correct. Okay, well, I need those ASAP. Okay. How, how ASAP are we talking? In 30 minutes. Mm. Where is, what state are you located in? We're here in Utah. Utah. That's Rose Park, Rose Utah. Rose Park, Utah. That's perfect. We actually have a, a facility. I can't guarantee 30 minutes unless I speak to my supervisor. Uh, let me place one hold, Jeremy, and let me find out about that quick ship. Okay, thank you very much, okay, sir. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> Roberto Villalobos, Del Monte. Sí, dígame. Tengo una pregunta. I have this guy, white guy, very nice fella. He thinks a luau's a big deal. Imagine <laughs> thinking idiot. that that's a big deal. That's oh just a God. feast for everyday islanders, okay? But white people make a big deal out of it. He thinks haystacks is real. What a joke. He's wanting to buy one of the products, our islander smoldering teak wood, burn wood special. Three cans, $49.99. He says he needs it in 30 minutes. He is located in Rose Park, Utah. Tell him if he needs it in 30 minutes, we have to sell him on the Tahiti Treat. The Tahiti Treat? So on top of what you're selling him already, he has to buy the Tahiti Treat, and then we'll get it to him in 30 minutes or less. 30 minutes or less, okay. And the price on that is? $299. For how many in the back? This one, the Tahiti Treat is very special, straight out of uh, Nepal. You know, special salts, makes it a little more ethnic. Tahiti treats Nepal more ethnic. Sounds good. I'll go ahead and go back to it. Jeremy, thank you for holding. I oh. just spoke to my supervisor named Roberto Villalobos del Monte. Oh, wow. That is a mouthful. It's, <laughs> it's very exotic, okay? I've had one of those before. And I think he can, he's part of the Latino community. Oh, wow. Tell him I said, hola, amigo. I will let him know. You say gracias after purchasing <laughs> our next product. So in order for us to get it to you in 30 minutes today, we can guarantee it. 
as long as you bundle the pack with our Tahiti Treat Special. Oh, God. $199. On it top is of the $49.99. imported from Nepal. It has salts, and it actually has bone marrow of Tahitians, okay? Infused. Actual bone marrow. It's the most authentic smell you can actually get because oh. it's from the source. A couple stem cells. But I, I, you know, I've been telling you about this vacation that I'm saving for. Could you do anything anything better, Karatu, than payments? Or my wife is going to kill me if she finds out. Well, I, you said you, you're going on a trip earlier. I heard you today. I didn't need to hear more because I have powers, and I understand she wants to be accepted into that community. She probably loves haystacks. If you purchase this Tahitian trick, treat, excuse me, it's going to allow you guys to be the exotic ones in Hawaii. So imagine Hawaii! going to a paradise vacation and being exotic in the paradise vacation. You I can guys are it. celebrities I, on the I can islands. see it now. I can see it now. Yes, Mr. Host. And I would I would take that deal right now. Okay, total payment after tax, three hundred and ninety-seven dollars and forty-six cents. We'll go ahead and do two installation payments. We'll half it. Just oh, because you, you are so much. kind, Jeremy. Thank you very much. You enjoy that luau. Make yourself some friends and always offer Hawaiian hate <laughs> You have a great day. Thank you. Oh, come on, man. Look at that, huh? People People can't can't even sell right cars. I can sell oh, Tahitian treats. On. And now we're at the party. <laughs> Anyone can <laughs> sell anything. <laughs> <laughs> now we're at the party. Brada. Brada. Maus. Load up the party. <laughs> Put the ukulele on. <laughs> Do ukulele type beat. <laughs> party music. <laughs> <laughs> it's this, it sounds like an infomercial. <laughs> we might have to do a killer mic, right? We want to go back to this? What, is, <laughs> what are we? What are we as far as time? Uh, we're at 120. 120. We can end it with a killer mic. Maybe an advice. You don't think so? Maybe. We can do a song about getting invited to a Polynesian barbecue. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be called the Polynesian... Should we call it Polynesian Luau or should we call it the barbecue? Why don't we just call it the Luau? Okay, the luau. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he just, wasn't even self convinced. He just didn't sound that cool. The luau. Yeah. Uh, the luau. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <coughs> the the pokeball special. You know? <laughs> what can we? Something cool like welcome to Mahalo or what is it? Something like a. The what did I call it first? Mahalo, my brother. Huh? Mahalo, my brother. Mahalo, my brother. <laughs> Oh, he kept saying brada. <laughs> brada. <laughs> Mahalo, my brada. But that sounds like somebody's going to die. You don't think so? What did I call it first? Was it the Polynesian? Uh, I can't remember. What's it? The Polynesian barbecue. Yeah, that's Yeah, that's, yeah, that's pretty... Come on, yeah, pretty... We need something really cool. Polynesian barbecue. <laughs> yeah, well, to make a song... <laughs> sure, sure, sure. Polynesian barbecue. That's fine by me. Or we'll see how the song goes, and then we'll name it after. <laughs> do you want to do ukulele type beat? That was hundred good. That one. Do you think so? Deck, we could be. Uh... I just wanted a bit shorter to see if any bass drops, which I doubt. <laughs> but do they have one that looks like uh, what was it saying like blue or more? Okay, maybe this works, huh? I like it. I feel like the beat's about yeah, to Yeah, maximize drop. it, hobby. Going to the Polynesian barbecue. Brada. Brada. Going to the Polynesian barbecue. One uso. My uso. Going to the Polynesian barbecue. Ciao! Hey, I'm going to the Polynesian barbecue, making lots of food for me and you. Brother! <laughs> Brother! Bring the rice! My Bring the pineapple! <laughs> Funny popo! The taro! Hey! Hello. Loco Mocos! At the Polynesian barbecue, I wanna say oh hi, oh hi. Really warm weather outside, nothing tastes better than some otai Polynesian barbecue. 
at the Polynesian barbecue. Do the items I'll be wearing oh. at the Polynesian barbecue. Q, 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 Q. We wear the grass skirts and we eat the musubi. Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Bring the haystacks, we'll kick you to the kerbusi. <laughs> Mahalo. No matter who sees invited, only family. <laughs> no, no, no. A no. lot of people, cause we have big families. Ukulele music in the back with ease. Listen to the breeze. Drinking couple brews. About to sing the blues. Yes! Mele Kimiki Maka. We're at the Polynesian barbecue. Polynesian barbecue, brother. We got the pork, we got the pineapple, we got the ladies, cause we're Ooh. at the Polynesian barbecue. My Uso, tell me where you are, my brother. Tell me where you are, my Coco. Hey, <laughs> Polynesian barbecue. We want the Polynesian barbecue. Tell me where you are. Rolling in the car, oh, where are we? Mary! Chow! Mata Uzi! Uli Uli Tanga! Ooh! Uh. This is for all the Usos! Low gout on the track! <laughs> red, red again! <laughs> Polynesian barbecue! <laughs> oh, come on, huh? <laughs> Tell me that was simple. Was that pretty decent? That was a good banger. It sounded good? like a song they would sing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I used to know with that when we should have determined <laughs> when people were going to jump in, you know? Mm. Was, uh, <laughs> but at least you got a good, good part yeah. of there, some bars, you know what yeah, I mean? Of course. Host? Had to. Well, that was pretty nice. Now yeah. we can close with some of the white things on <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> we're at the Polynesian barbecue. <laughs> Dude, that's already good, right? The host, dude. I'm gonna have, dude. I'm gonna have potential right there, host. <laughs> Polynesian barbecue. <laughs> oh. Tell me where you are. I'm driving in my car. You know that we a star at the Polynesian barbecue. <laughs> or do you want to do the last one? Close it with the Polynesian barbecue. Polished uh, song. Polynesian barbecue. We're doing the verses too? No, we'll just, just do the, the chorus. Yeah, and we can just make up some verses in the meanwhile. But now I think we can have it we have the thing cleaned up how we want, right? Polynesian barbecue. Tell me where we are. Driving in the car. I'm feeling at the star at the Polynesian barbecue. Just go to history, Javi. I was gonna say like they're at they're at the bottom. Just keep scrolling down on the left. History. No, go up. <laughs> History. <laughs> Since Hobby doesn't like history. <laughs> I don't like history. So right? Polynesian barbecue. I don't remember anything that I said. So we'll, 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 we'll try to make something out of it. Tell me where you are. My Uso's in the car. Roll into the park. Got the Polynesian barbecue. Okay, I think that's a decent that's hook. Not, that's a good hook. Polynesian barbecue. Tell me where you are. My Uso's in my car. We grill it. Maybe grilling at the park or luau at the park. Either one. Okay. Polynesian barbecue. Tell me where you are. Rolling in the car. Luau at the park. At the Polynesian barbecue. Okay, I think got it. And then, Javi, you got to make sure your ad libs are on, on um, point. Yeah. And then when I stop doing the chorus, you think you can do a you can do a couple bars right there. Alex? Maybe we'll see. You know you're gonna talk about maybe you're talking about how you're making the how the Hawaiian punch. You know yeah. how you roast the Spitfire pig. Yeah. A couple you know uh, girls in their skirts and stuff like you did on the first one. Okay, we ready? Sure. Come on, Hoss. I need more energy than that. You got it? <laughs> well, this is a relaxing song. <laughs> okay. Relax. You wanted to do this, okay? We were about to help people, but now we're just making <laughs> yeah, just song. Okay. <laughs> Money first. <laughs> we had a great sale. <laughs> the best sale we've ever had in the history of this company. Okay, yeah. do the introduction. You know, it's like, welcome to the barbecue. And then we'll, when it drops, we'll go into the chorus. Who's doing the intro? You want to do the intro or Javi? Javi, you can do it, right? Because you're the guy. Hey, brother. My brother. I hope you can make it to the park. At Rose Park. West Valley. 
No, just Rose Park. My brother, my toko, my us. Let's get loose and hang caboose. <laughs> Come through. Polynesian barbecue. Ooh. Polynesian barbecue. Ooh. Tell me where you are. Don't I'm go. driving in my car. Who's the who's who's saw the stars? Who's the who's who's the who's Polynesian barbecue. Ooh. Ooh. Umaga. Umaga. Polynesian barbecue. Tell me where you are. Usos in my car. Us, us, no, us. at the park at the Polynesian. Yeah. Pull up with my family to the park. I'm trying to have a barbecue. Let's make some pork. Uh, you got the grass skirts. I got the grass blunts. About to get lit. Ukulele's on fit. Yeah. We got the Hawaiian shirt sound. Unbutton up and top. Get our breeze on. It's at the park. Sunny days. Doesn't matter. Rain for days. We with family. We get our hands raised. Uh. Polynesian barbecue. Ooh. Polynesian barbecue. Ooh. Tell me where we are. Don't the oozles in the car. Oos, Grilling oos, at oos. the park at the at the Polynesian barbecue. Ooh. Polynesian barbecue. Ooh. Tell me where we are. Don't the oozles in the park. Oos, oos. Grilling in the park at the at the. Doesn't matter if you're going through strife in life If you win a pickle, we'll play pickleball on the court That's life, we got the speaker song playing reggae And maybe something like country mm. Eating good in the neighborhood This ain't Chili's, it ain't Applebee's It's a luau, got the pork on the grill The spit roast, the pineapple, squid squirts uh, We got the rules in the cooler keep our cool hmm we got the people up north keep it southern style too i don't know what that means it doesn't matter because green's got me smiling for days that's mean polynesian barbecue Ooh. polynesian barbecue Ooh. tell me where you are the oozles in the car Oose. rolling to the park as we headed to the Polynesian barbecue, Polynesian barbecue. Tell me where you are. Go, go, the oozles in the car. Oos, Lewis oos, in the park. Oos. We going to the Polynesian barbecue, Polynesian barbecue. Tell me where you are. Go, go, the oozles in the car. Oos. Headed to oos. the park. To the, to the this is for all the families out there. It doesn't matter if you're not part of Polynesians. We invite you to the barbecue. Be happy, be thankful, be grateful. Mahalo. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> Let's go, okay? Unless we forget, house. Una vez más. Come on, try.